Welcome to our 5 minute video on how to use the SNPP. It's easy, just follow these steps which we will review on this video. As we review the steps, remember these important aspects of a good sustainable planning program. Transparency, consistency, measurability, compliance, and feasibility because if it's not easy it won't get done. So let's get started. When you first log into the SNPP, you will always land on the member's home page. Watch for the red arrows as I walk you through some of the features. You can always view the 4-minute video instruction demo, and then it's a good idea to start with the manual, so just click on the tab for Manual. This is Section 2 of the Manual, the sustainability policy all ready for you to use, starting with your purpose, principles, values, and more. You do not have to create a policy with templates or wizards because it is already written for you. If you follow this manual, you can be sure that you are in compliance with industry standards and using these navigation buttons to get around, let's go to another section. Here is the section on waste management as an example. Here you can see that we introduce each sustainability impact with a brief overview followed by goals, guidelines, and measurable objectives for meeting planners to follow. Using the manual will assure your compliance and consistency. Next, you can go to the Planner Profile page. This Planner Profile page is your personal dashboard, set up automatically when you register. This demonstrates the feasibility of the system. It is so easy to use. It shows all your meetings and scores, but only you can see it. You just click on Create a New Meeting to start scoring a meeting as you plan it or after you plan it. This takes you to the first of two scoring forms that you will complete for each meeting. For the compliance score, you simply answer the yes or no questions for each of the guidelines in the manual, and your score computes as you answer the questions. Again, consistency is assured by addressing all of the guidelines contained in the SMPP manual and you can click on the red box on the left to save and return later and the green box on the right if you have finished and you are ready to lock in your score. The second form, the measurement score, captures the quantities for each of the measurable objectives in the manual. For these items you will be using data that is normally under your control or easily available to you. As you populate the data in the boxes on the right, your percentage will be computed automatically and red shows up when you need to improve. Green pops up when you are doing very well. Your score computes automatically and is averaged with the first form to give you a total score. This form demonstrates measurability and once again you will click on the green box at the bottom to save and finalize your score. This will bring you back to your planner profile page and here you will see your finalized scores. If you check these boxes on the left, you will see your ratings appear and then you can click to see your ratings posted in the directories that you have selected. This is the individual directory of sustainable meeting planners. If you click on your name, your selected meetings will appear with their rating and your overall rating is shown beside your name. This directory lets you be transparent as you move through your career. If you change jobs, your individual directory remains intact. This is the company directory of sustainable organizations, agencies, institutions, and companies. If you click on the name, all the selected meetings will show up. Again, this public directory allows a company or organization to be transparent. Anyone can view your company, but it is your decision which meetings you want to list and be included in your average. You can also protect client confidentiality, if that is an issue, by using a title for the meeting that does not disclose your client's identity. On the other hand, you may want to showcase an organization's events and their sustainability rating. What else does the SMPP include? I'll show you examples of these items on the next few slides. You can download and use our optional interactive checklist. They're very useful as all of them follow the same set of guidelines included in the manual. This one can be used to pre-qualify venues, or you can ask your venues to submit it with their offer. This checklist can be posted on the event website to encourage participants and exhibitors to follow the relevant guidelines from your SMPP program. 
This management report is used to compare meetings from one to the next and track improvement. Good improvement shows up in green, while red means you're going in the wrong direction. The company version also includes a section on the steps for companies and organizations to follow in order to launch the SMPP program and fully comply with the standards. Also included a handy step-by-step -step chronological list for planners to follow for each meeting or event. This is one of the three optional scoring forms. This one is for the APEX standards. It lists the requirements of the standards and way that where they are addressed in the SMPP manual. If you're doing a good job of implementing the SMPP, you will score 100%. If you have your own sustainability program, you can use this form to see how well you are complying with the standards. This is the ISO scoring form. It follows the same format as the APEX form. These forms allow you to determine your level of compliance with each of the standards, but they are entirely optional. Use them in case you want to double check that you are doing everything required by a particular standard. Remember, if you adopt and use the SMPP, you are guaranteed to be in compliance with all of them. So in the interest of time, we'll let you explore the other features on your own, but we've covered most of the highlights. Now you're ready to go. I urge you to take the steps, sign up, get your rating, and get listed. This will improve your credibility, competitive advantage, reputation, and leadership as a sustainable planner. Thank you very much.